Chat was saying the issue was is I didn't take her off the plan fast enough. And you know what? They're probably right. I should have. I'm not going to argue with you there. You hold out for $1? I won't forget. I, I mean, it's just, I used to work in finance, dude. Like, I used to make people loans. So, I'm not saying that you shouldn't stiff the bank. If you've got a personal loan. And you're, you're hard up. And you, you need a default or whatever. I get it, man. But, um... If you take out a debt and you don't pay it back like that, that reflects on you as a person. How much can I default as a personal loan? I don't think there's a limit, man. You go crazy. Help the Beastmaster complete their quest. Let's go. Beast handlers left the village. She's the one that, yeah, I mean, you may, you assume she didn't have $50. Rather than, I'm going to pay him $49 so I can feel like I can win the argument. <laughs> you know? I'm not Google! Beast Handler heard tale of a mysterious egg and they're ready to command the first epic beast. Help them learn everything there's known about these ravenous raptors. Okay. Well, that's a beast master. Micro raptor? Last time I was in Ferris when I was commanding the monkey army. Spend your tickets. I feel like I need to have like a second Beastmaster. I mean, they're doing okay. We might, there might be a little leaking. The, there, the beasts are going to get evolved. We need, we need to upgrade one first. Remind me of someone complaining in Dawn of War, Dark Crusade, that I put down an energy pylon and whenever how much energy I'm losing by not doing it as soon as possible? That sounds like a you problem. Sounds like a skill issue. But I mean, whatever. I mean, I, I, I think of myself as somebody who has saved my family hundreds, if not thousands of dollars over the years. And uh, somebody thought maybe they were above that. <laughs> can I, can you move him? You can. In all seriousness, I'm technically right. Oh, I know I'm right. <laughs> I've got no doubt about that. So we got to merge him. Cannot merge this tower. Merge. Okay. It would it would definitely be a good am I the asshole post. When I you know when I first brought it up, everybody was like, oh you're the asshole. You're the asshole. I know I'm not the asshole. I think you keep merging forever. It's like a paragon. Uh, there's a flying one and there's a water one. A pterodon and like a big... I don't know. It's not letting me click it yet. We gotta do the quest. I guess he just gets stronger. Where's, where's the airplane? Where's the helicopter?
We got a piranha. Hope that like, like right there might be a little bit better. Right there. It's definitely weird. It's definitely different. Uh, it goes on sale for like a dollar or two sometimes. On like a Steam sale, it gets really cheap. There's in-game real money purchases you can make, but... Th there's like no... No reason for it. I should be grinding Dark Tide. I saw Vermintide is still getting updates. Vermintide too. Doesn't pay to win monkey? I think I gave them money at one point. I think I spent $10 on something, but I can't remember what. Might have been like unlocking the, the heroes, which is funny now because I've got like 30,000 monkey money. So like that was kind of a waste. I'm like marginum? I, I don't... I assume they have to be in range of each other. You have over 100,000 monkey money? I mean, if you do the contested territories, I mean, it's all you need, right? Well, we easily won that one. I feel like the kids are going to enjoy this. <laughs> this seems like a very child-friendly update. <laughs> the bird's kind of tweaking out. Kids play monkey? Uh, Bloons Tower Defense 6 is like if it were both chess and checkers at the same time. In that both children and adults can find stuff that's enjoyable in it. Kids just want to see the monkey. And they want to see the airplane. Or whatever. <laughs> In my experience. But yeah, they'll, they'll, they'll watch the hell out of this game, man. They say, where's the airplane? Where's the helicopter? Where are the balloons? They won't see the balloons because, like, we're playing on easy on Candyland and he has an airplane and a helicopter. <laughs> of course you don't see them, child. They're getting popped before they show up on the screen. Uh, there, there has to be an update, Miss Chances. And then you got to click on the golden egg, I think. You got you to gotta, uh, do a quest. It's like a new system. I mean, I'm just going to keep merging. Oh, we can see uh, camo balloons. 
it'll be interesting to see all the upgrades. All right. Oh, we might. I don't know if we're going to need quests or money to fully upgrade them. Awesome. You've helped the beast handlers and they're ready to join the fight. Good luck exploring all their upgrades and lucking the power of the beasts. Thank you. A support monkey. He'll support them with death. <laughs> uh, uh, click, click the girl with the scroll and then you'll see the quest. I am not. I mean, just like this is the, like the one map. Like, there's like it's just it's not easy. It's like it's like actually my hell. <laughs> just playing this one map over and over again on easy. We'll do this one on hard. I haven't done it yet. Oh, maybe I want um like Ben. I think I want, like, Ben. So we can just pump money into him. Rules are made to be broken. Oh, they made Ben expensive. He's going to need something. He can't do that on his own. Let's get like a, a glue monkey. And then like a ninja monkey. Still not enough. Oh my god. Oh, this should be enough. There's a new update? Big update! New monkey. We can't, we can't afford him yet. He's like the airplane. We need to save up for the, the beast master. First, we're going to get Benjamin out so we can get the money. Technically, we might want to get one farm out too. Maybe like one bank. How much is it to place? He's cheap. Two, 270. But he doesn't come with anything. Like free to start. Rules are made to be broken. But we're gonna we're gonna mostly go into them. I don't know. I, I'm going for the middle path. So. What we We're gonna get the dinosaurs. We're gonna we're gonna get a farm. We're gonna make a farm into a bank. We're gonna have to upgrade this ninja. Probably like now. Uh oh. That's fine, we got tax.
I think we want the middle path, right? Yeah, lucky bank. I don't know if we can save it up in time, actually. We need an awful lot of money to get a monkey bank out. Like, we can handle everything until we get to the leads, and then we're like, we're not going to be able to handle anything. We're not going to be able to pop the leads. Is it round 28? Yeah, maybe we can get it out. Get out like an alchemist. This is a heavy economy for a T-Rex. Alright, hold on. Let's just see. Let's see. At what point... Alright, so if we can get the Adasaurus... And we can. Oh, hold on, we need, oh, we need the money. That's cool. You can move them around. Nibble Snarf just resubscribed. Join the for you playthrough on YouTube. Just We're about to die. I'm enjoying your MH for you play. Show hat. <laughs> what the hell? Is what does that mean? Thanks, Jeff. All right, we got, we got to move him up front. Cause he needs to pop the, the leads. Well, thank you. I, I will... I will I'll do what I can. We have Velociraptor. All right, now we don't have enough. So now we, we got to keep investing in Velociraptors. I think? I guess the interesting thing is you can move them around, so you can do a lot of micro. Like, you can fight up here, and then you can move them down. Question is, is whether or not he's going to be strong enough to chew through a Moab when he's been leveled up a little bit. He does look larger. He, he looked like he got a little bit bigger there. What am I doing? We're, we're doing stuff with the dinosaur. Are you strong enough? Should I get you balloon jitsu? Probably. Have you tried turning it off and on again? probably set you to strong. All right, we're going to collect now. It looks like it get, get upgraded one more time. It looks like there's a level cap there. Is that plus 16? I don't know if he can merge again. Does the level four seem like they can get very strong. You know what? Oh. Wait, why are you down there? Who put you down? <laughs> Did I put you down there? Uh, guys? I don't know this is going to be good enough. This is going to be tough. 
Oh, he just ate it. <laughs> he just ate it. Okay. Uh, we want to put him up there. And actually, we might want to get another one. A falcon one? As you can see, uh, camo, which is going to be helpful. I mean, you could definitely clear most maps with, like, only Beastmaster. I don't think there's any question about that. Oh, we've got enough for another experience upgrade. <laughs> Do I want to get the giant condor first? Ceramic and can detect camo. New unit? Oh, it's awesome, man. Probably could have gotten a little bit greedier with banks. Maybe after I collect again, I'll get another bank. I wouldn't mind getting one of each, though. <laughs> Thank you, Nibble Star. They have given thirty gift subs in the channel. Black doll. So he needs four giant condors to reach max giant condor. Uh, guys. They're like, he's like humping that Moab, dude. <laughs> he's messing that Moab up. What are you doing to that Moab? And then we need, well, actually we'll, we'll merge this one. Go anywhere in the range of the merged units. I mean, this is another one. It's an expensive tower. I mean, you know, almost 10,000 is pretty expensive. You merge the smaller ones and the bigger ones as well. There's probably like uh, a math equation you can do for how much points they add. But there's definitely a max level. Like, the Golden Eagle is 8 out of 24, so, like, he could be boosted up to 24. Then the Giant Condor goes all the way up to 64. He's worth double. Might be, like, a spacious, spacious issue. I don't know if they are, they're all, like, technically the same. We have a high-level synopsis. Oh, God! We have a... Uh, you have me losing. Because <laughs> we don't see camo leads. Uh... Hold on, what do I do? How do I take care of camo leads? <laughs> Forgot about this. Well, didn't lose. 
Uh, there are no cross paths on the tower. Dude. You don't, you don't cross path. Uh, guys. He doesn't see. So he's the only one that can see. So none of them can handle camo leads. Maybe at tier five. I want to get up to the tier five. We don't have a hundred thousand. But he is max level, right? 32. No, he needs one more. It's kind of hard to keep track of them. So he should be at max level now. Yeah, they just need help with camo lids. One way or the other. Just a village with camo detection, the way to go on uh, the dinosaur. Level up. Well, round sixty three came and went. We didn't even didn't even uh, register. Nice. I guess we're gonna have an issue with camo leads again <laughs> if I don't do anything. Yeah, any experience they had before stays on him. I wonder which one it has to be on. So if I put that there. I wonder if that works. I guess we'll find out. Camelids should show up before 80, right? It's either that or level... 64 of this guy can handle it. We might just check a sandbox. So he gets a um, stun too. I mean, they definitely, I don't think they need to be tier five in order to basically solo. I guess it's the opposite of solo. It's literally a duo.
The bird is just crazy. It reminds me a little bit of like the helicopter with the push, except maybe stronger. It's probably more money than the helicopter at this this level. You might want to take a look at this. It stunned it. I don't know how powerful it was, but it definitely stunned it. All right, let's just test. Andy Falls on Sandbox. So we want... I just want to see, like, the max... Right, he's max level. I want to see what happens if I send camo leads up. Nothing. Okay. Uh, I don't think the micro raptor can do it. I don't. I don't think he could. It's just a thing to know. Now, I think both the Raptor uh, and the Orca can handle leads. The bird cannot. <laughs> Look at it go. Orca's expensive, man. That is like almost, I mean, it's close to a hundred thousand. Nope. <laughs> okay. So, you know, if, who is the main one? This is the main one? If I put that there, can you see it? No. If I put it here, will you see it? Yes. So it's got to be on the main, the main controller. So the merging doesn't matter. It's got to be on the main guy. Let's send a hundred camelids. That's kind of insane. Let's send a thousand camelids. Two hundred. T Rex does a lot of damage. Let's uh, let's do let's do this. T Rex doesn't care, man. That's crazy. I just sent 200 ZOMGs. Look at him. Look at him go. He's like freaking out, man. Unreal. Uh, let's try, uh, let's try like 20 ZLNGs. Power cannon, hello. Look at him. He just like, like slurps them down. Co-op, we're testing out the new tower, dude. I, I'm still unlocking it. I don't want to share my experience. Let's try 20 DTs. Dude, all they need is a village, man. 20 ZLNGs. Look at him go, man! Wow. 
You see that? That's unreal, dude. They are very strong. Uh-oh. Bird! Bird couldn't... Bird choked at the end. Bird, I'm very sus on. I mean, obviously, he's only tier 4. These guys are only tier 4, man. They're not even... They're not even at their maximum power. They're not even close. That's wild. The T-Rex seems like the strongest. He's, he's also the most expensive, right? No, Orc is more expensive. T-Rex almost felt like he did more damage. And he's cheaper. This is a new map. You know, I could do Benjamin. He technically is like a money monkey, but what if I just did like like a good monkey? Got like a Sada, something like very, very money efficient. go. I wonder if there's like a King Arthur sort of... What? <laughs> what did I do? You can close it. farm. Let's probably get one farm. Closes when there's a six on the top. You can click it and it opens. I mean, I'm a, I'm a little confused about it, Amatsu. You know, I might do something horrible, and at a certain point, I might just sell Sada. Once, once my T-Rex is up and going, I guess we might end up having to sell her. Yeah, it closed. <laughs> what does it mean? I don't know what it means. We could, you know, we could just make like one bank. And then just like chill on our bank. Even without Benjamin, banks are still good. Could we afford it? You probably cannot chew through lead. You can. Mm -hmm. 
They're juiced in the water? What happens when it closes? Do they get smushed? It's definitely not the ideal farming strategy, but I don't think we need to be super ideal. I think we're gonna be fine on this map. All right. Oh, hold on. We're gonna need to be stronger. You know what? Let's, uh, do that. Come on. Econ harder? <laughs> I should econ harder. Can she handle all that on her own? Probably. probably want to start working on a second Velociraptor before we go into another T-Rex, I think. Maybe glue splatter would be okay, too. And we're getting close to that point we're going to need the uh, village, too. is whether or not this is going to be enough. For the Moab. It'll probably be enough for a Moab. For, I, I can't see how there being three of these guys isn't enough. Three Velociraptors. Be a little lacking. I don't know if we're gonna be able to get max T Rex out. Well, we can definitely get a max T Rex out by round 63. Especially with a bank, we should be fine. This is like 30,000 by 63 with a bank. I guess you don't even really have to worry about combining them too quickly because the actual base Beastmaster is like pretty cheap.
This guy's just eating everything. You could probably put an alchemist on the main Beastmaster too, I assume. Because it looks like you got to buff the Beastmaster, not the Beast. Oh, we need one more, actually. I don't know what I think about the bird grab. I mean, maybe, like, final in the lineup to, like, knock back the Moabs, but, like, they're not there for, like, good damage. Like, they're good for, like, knocking back Moabs and cleanup, but they're not good for actual damage. Kind of disappointed with them. Before. Probably just start merging now. Is it because he's not max level? Because, like, he was crushing everything before. Maybe it was the Orca. Was it the Orca? Alright, well, time to find out what happens. <laughs> I mean, he seems pretty strong. You know, I bet he pairs really well with an ice monkey. Maybe something like this mid path here. Because anything that gets frozen, he's going to deal extra damage to. And I know he could eat them. I don't want to do too much that's going to get in the way of... Yeah, he's got insane AoE. He's totally cracked. He just swallows... He just swallows it. Oh, we can we can get the other we can get the final upgrade. We only need seventy five thousand six hundred. Can we get there? Maybe. I don't think we econed hard enough for that. Maybe at like round seventy nine. <laughs> it's a lot of money. That is a insane amount of money for like a normal game. An enemy red from battle. Like you would you would need a lot of a lot of farms. And I mean there's other, you know, there's other more degenerate strats you can do. They're essentially paragons? I mean, they are. I mean, they're, they're, they're the paragons without the paragon. Uh, much easier to build paragons, uh, for sure. Way easier to build. The 
but that's like a lot of a lot of money. I, I could see them being very useful on the uh, the boss balloon maps, especially the T-Rex. Maybe the Orca too, it's just he's kind of expensive. Even more so than this guy, <laughs> who's already really expensive. Look at him just snacking away. His range still sucks? That That's not a... That's a bad take. <laughs> His range may not be far, but when he's got infinite pierce, he's only got to bite once. I was testing him in the uh, map, and like I sent like 200 ZOMGs, and he just like ate them. And that was at tier 4. It wasn't even at tier 5. I mean, his Pierce is already so high at tier four. Strong. Even this ice is too, he can't even eat the things in time. He's like attack shooter paragon? Yeah. No, his, his, his damage is insane and his, his pierce is crazy. I didn't really like the bird. The bird was pretty bad. No offense to the bird. Just his existence will definitely make some chimp maps probably a little easier to do. In some way. He doesn't seem bad. Almost got the other tier 5s unlocked. That's nice. That didn't take long. He just needs um camo detection. It's a little strange they don't let you move control around between the different beast masters. Maybe there's wor they're worried about like some sort of degenerate buff strats or something. I don't really know what you could do. But I, I think I think you should be able to move him around. I don't know, maybe I'm missing something. A oh, Alkit can't buff it. I haven't even tested the Alk yet. The um the village has to be on the Beastmaster that's handling him. I know that much. I think they'd be too strong if you could alk buff them. I mean, as it is. Maybe the bird would be really strong then. I mean, I guess you could always just like... Still give it monkey intelligence bureau on the bird if you really wanted to use the bird for some reason to get through leads. I was gonna go a little bit longer. See if we can get that upgrade. Just 
Central City looks like. We're going to pick up DDT? I don't know. I mean, uh, he definitely gets anti-Moab abilities, but he can't he can't hurt Camo on his own. He might be able to attack it because of the Moab property, but by default, he, he just ignores leads. He might need men in black for it. Oops. <laughs> Screwed up. I will do a normal map. Maybe we'll try the Orca. Do double HP Moabs. Rules are made to be broken. Ben Jammin. We'll do the uh we'll do orcas. I need to upgrade you. You look like I need to upgrade you. I put you to last. I don't know how long he can make it. <laughs> how long can he go? Let's talk about a match made in heaven. Ninja with a nor free dart monkey. This loop carries hard. Econ Hunter, look, this is, this is about <laughs> the most econ heavy start you could ever do. You come from the Hall Masters of Bloons oh, yeah. uh, Battles 2? It's like Bloons Battles, but you only fight against Bloons and not other players. All right, hold on. We need, we need to actually, like, probably. Upgrade. This game is not PvP. Nope. There are challenges against other players. Um, There's a, a mode called Contested Territories. And in Contested Territories, uh, you're going against Have other teams to, like, kind of, like, kind of, like, time attack, kind of, like, speedrun things a little bit. It might be a little bit familiar to you. All right, keep going. Keep going on the farms. It does go on sale sometimes for, like, one or two dollars. I'd say that's kind of a nice time to pick it up. It's on mobile, too. You have to pop the balloons faster. Uh, kind of, there are uh, race modes against other players where uh, basically you're always competing against the other teams in the contested territories and you're trying to beat their scores. So sometimes it's like least number of upgrades. Sometimes it's speed. One to $2, I know. Pretty bougie. Um... Those are, those are the main ones. Uh, time, like as in a race. Sometimes it's time raced against a boss. Oh, we're going to need some. Ooh, God. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Turn up auto stay. We're going to need something for the... Uh, the leads that are coming out. Can these eat leads? I think a great white can eat a lead. Do I, will I have 3,000? Let's find out. We should have 3,000. So, yeah, each, 
uh, each farm will drop a certain number of banana bunches around, and they're worth different amounts depending on the upgrade paths you have. I think we need to put the orca like. We'll do it like right here. It should be enough just in time. Please. Please, for the love of God. Okay, we got it. All right, we should be fine. Actually, that, I'm going to say that's good. Not good? Not, well, kind of okay. It's a, it works a little funny. That works a little differently than I thought. Have you tried turning it off? Level five orca one shot bad? Yeah, they're pretty strong, dude. They're good, but I think you kind of need like, I think you still need like T-Rex. Interaction's a little funny. I'm gonna say it, it's a little funny. Like right, right there actually might be good. Let's see what that looks like. It's weird. Game over, man. It's real. It's real weird. All right, I want. I want to get that Velociraptor upgrade. Is that the Beastmaster? He is. He just came out like an hour ago. Uh, will he come to battles too? Probably eventually. People are still figuring him out. I'm still figuring him out. He's like a Paragon. I don't think Paragons are in the, ba the battle game. He's, li he's like a Paragon. We're going to need actual like units to like kill, <laughs> kill the Moab. Maybe we just upgrade the Orca. Maybe we got the money. Do we got the money for an Orca? Will we have money? We will not have 17,000 for an Orca. That is not happening. Will we have 10,000 for a T-Rex? Probably not. <laughs> Do we just like yellow it? Maybe they can handle it. I'm going to, you know what? I'm going to say they could do it. I'm believing in you guys. Are the A rounds uh, the same? They are. There's different modes. Do I have them memorized? Uh, I remember the important rounds. Like round 28, round 25, round 40. Those are like important rounds. We might just die though. I mean, it's very possible we're gonna die this next round because, because I am not doing what I should be doing. Yeah, that is not good. That is not looking great. <laughs> that is not right. I've already made. I've already made mistakes. Uh, guys. Definitely, I've made mistakes. <laughs> these guys. These guys need to be like more, like near. Fight them! Oh wow! All right, never mind. Take it all back. Bird wouldn't have leaked? Probably not. Orca's very expensive. Okay, 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 okay. I understand. I screwed up. I know I did. Turning it off and on again. You did like no. Oh, oh we just gotta go back. <laughs> <laughs> just gotta go back. I'm on round 42? How is this possible? Have you tried turning it off and on again? My econ's gonna keep stalling as long as I keep sucking. 
Keep putting money into these orcas. Yes. And I want to put money into the banks. There, there are some difficulties that change the, the way stuff goes down. Oh, does the level zero Beastmaster like smack things? Have you tried turning it off and on again? That's kind of funny. What is econ? Uh, economics? Making money? Building farms to get bananas? To get more bananas? To get more farms? Get another worker. I'm just like, I'm not convinced. I kind of I want one T Rex. I kind of want T Rex and Orcas. I know I shouldn't be splitting them up. And then I gotta, I gotta give them camo detection. I, I, I've made, I've made, I've made mistakes. I know I've made mistakes. I spent a lot of money on orcas. Uh, guys? Eco tick? Eco should really be, they should really call it an econ tick. This is economy. But I'm not going to be a, a big nerd about it. Uh, guys? Try not to be a big nerd about it. Have you tried turning it off and on again? Eco rounds? I'm just saying, like, eco is, like, ecology, not econ. Two different things. The big, the, the orca's just weird. Like, the spacing on it is very important. I'm gonna wait for this to completely max out, and then I'm just gonna collect all. Game over, man. How are we, like, how are we leaking, man? This guy not strong enough? He needs probably another. If he's leaking, then we're definitely gonna leak to, like, <laughs> something. All right, well, we've got banks. I guess we could still probably get away with one more bank. Dude. Need his bunches, man. What's the best farm to use in this game? Uh, uh, banks probably are the best if you're just trying to get the maximum total amount of money. Especially with like a lot of micro and buying and selling, banks go crazy. Uh, but there's there's a couple of different strategies. Things are kind of like slipping by and like, I'm getting a little nervous. How are you slipping you by? Turning it off and on again? How are you slipping by him? You need help? You might need help. You might need a little bit of slow. Let's do that. I want to get him in here. I want to give him. 
Can I get me in the range of either of these villages? Here, let's do that. It's just like, so you look at them like banks with the way they gain interest will definitely get you the most money, especially with like once you start getting into IMF loans and stuff, it gets really weird. Banana Central will get you the, like the absolute most amount of banks, uh, bananas, especially if you start like smashing them into villages. Just like without thinking about it. And then central markets work really well with, like, the merchant men, which is, like, the pirate ship economy path. I mean, if you're going for uh, a banana central, like, 108,000 is going to be, like, the smallest of your worries. That's not going to be too bad. Oh, we got through round 63. I didn't even notice. I mean, the, the absolute... And again, they might have patched it, but the absolute sweatiest strategy that I'm aware of is like buying and selling IMF loans on cooldown. Can beasts be out buffed? Somebody in chat said they could. I haven't tested it myself, though. So I can't tell you for sure. We should be able to get the final upgrade out. And we'll take a look at the final upgrade on the Orca. Might even be able to get the other one. Uh, nice. Yeah, beasts need a little... Well, it's, it's a little strange. Like, if they're really clumped up, it's no problem. But if you've got, like, long lines of extremely fast-moving balloons, it can be a little bit hard on the beast. The three strongest towers of the game. Well, the super monkey can make, like, a... Like a ninja... What is it called? A temple? A true sun god? It's 540,000. He's got, like, a special buff, too. I'd say that's probably, like, the absolute strongest. But, yeah, I mean, what what do you mean by strong? Like, best popping power? I mean, that would be it. Outside of maybe some of the heroes. I don't know. I think Adora and Churchill can both get kind of cracked in the right circumstances. You know, are they going down a straight line? Are they going around in a curve? Max scale, true, max scale true sun god is like the easy answer to like the strongest tower in the game. Druid and Dartling. Dartling can be very good for Moab damage, but is otherwise not amazing. Um, Druid can be really good. You know, I mean, you still... I mean, the Spirit of the Forest is great now because it's economy and like wide range damage. Avatar Wrath is just like... Damage. Superstorm is too expensive for what it does, but it is an interesting choice in, like, some situations. But, I mean, I, I would never go out of my way to get it. Most popping power per dollar? Probably a ninja? <laughs> per the dollar, I mean. Free dart monkey? It's, like, infinite value. The towers are pretty well balanced. I mean, almost every tower has at least one upgrade path where there's a situation where you might really want to use it. Is really what it comes down to. We might just get this money normally. I mean, Dark Monkey's amazing. Flowers beta. Hold on. There's no question about that. Dark Monkey kicks ass. You just like to see the plane? I want to see the plane. Where's the helicopter? <laughs> I'm going to collect early just so I can get the T-Rex out. Nice. Look at him go! 
He's scary looking, man. What a scary looking dude. What is he at? He needs two more? Does Sentai? I don't know what Sentai is. Is that like something to do with the uh, superhero Darkling Squad or whatever? Sentai Churchill? Churchill's good, but he's usually just too expensive to get out. There's sometimes in that uh, contested territory situation where he's good. You know, he sees camo and he can pop leads. Anything that can handle camo leads on their own is automatically like a really good tower. But for the most part, you don't see him played a lot like on, you know, chimp maps and stuff like that because it's just too expensive to get out there. One more. Yeah, like Biker Bones is just a skin for Striker Jones. Doesn't change their abilities or anything like that. You might want to take a look at this. This reaches the whole screen, apparently. I think we do we get everything? Almost. I think I want to unlock the uh Megalodon first. Yeah, I mean, it's just like Beast Handlers are just like another kind of sort of Paragon. We're just going to keep playing on free play a little bit because I want, I want to max out this T-Rex. Sure is purple, man. Kids are gonna love this, man. Kids love dinosaurs. They're gonna freak out. <laughs> they got some spikes. That's it, man. Snaps on the whole screen. I guess his power synergizes with himself. A lot more straightforward than you hoped? Um, I mean, your positioning of them still kind of matters a little bit, right? Because the, they, they really need, like, a village buff on them. going to be a lot of money, so I'm going to need a lot of banks. <laughs> going to need a lot more money. I'd, I'd like to get max of each one and just see kind of how they do. You might want to take a look at this. Is that 400,000 pop? He's moving slow, man. I guess I could move him up. I mean, for now, he could probably, like, Level up. go up here. I guess that's the really cool thing about them. Like, don't, don't undervalue the fact that you can just position them however the hell you want. Like, the micro potential on them is kind of insane. They're almost maxed out. Just black now. Oh, no.
Oh, there are purple balloons in the game? Yep. Magic resistant balloons? There sure are. Uh, guys. Oh, what the hell did I just make? I just made an IMF? That was a mistake. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> it's not really a mistake, but I wasn't planning on really doing anything with it. He's got some range on him, man. He's moving out. <laughs> he jumped AG. He went far, dude. Man. Those are the purple balloons right there. we doing on money halfway there <coughs> oh no our t-rex move them over <laughs> so we can eat them <laughs> that's actually really funny there's definitely some neat stuff you can do with like where you position them and then like moving them around There's definitely a big trade-off, but I would say a max level beast is definitely better than four individual beasts of anything else. I mean, as far as I can tell. <laughs> it's just, it gets a little silly, though. Can't reach it, man. I'm going to have to start putting out the, uh, the bird. Yeah, I'll put him, like, right there. I mean, there, there's definitely going to be certain breakpoints of, like, power, power spikes at different levels. But I, I think it's really their max level that they kind of go crazy. Megalodon! Good night, Vienna. He just ate that. <laughs> He's not even max level yet. He's eating it. Oh, yeah. Does he need two more? Oh, he can't. He's not close enough. Kind of the the clicking on it is a little, a little hard. Oh, he's, he's about to get larger, or at least he's going to get more shiny soon. They're smart. Oh, yeah, look at that. He's jumping out over there. And there's a definitely a thing to do because, like, he damages as he drags backwards. So, we can definitely see DDTs are a weak spot. Definitely. Which we were saying, like, if they're super fast, it's a little bit of a problem. Get a bird with village? I'm working on it. I'm going to get him very soon.
we're obviously going to start falling apart kind of soon. Some very... Oh, okay, it's showing the direction of the upgrades. <laughs> He's like... <laughs> Stop that! Needs a little help. Like, I think, um... I think it would help to have something like a uh, carpet of spikes. Maybe the white hot spikes? Just like down, just to help with the DDTs. Maybe even give it like a little. I don't know if it helps, but. Like that. Moab glue? Sure. Get some glue up here. I know they just buffed the glue guy, right? Now, you can only make one max tier Beastmaster, right? So, wait, what's the deal with these cross paths? Can I just, like, have extra? That's really weird. That's, that's a little, you know, that's a little complicated as well. Look at him, just he just swallows him. Takes a little while to drag him back, but... <laughs> he takes care of it. That's wild, dude. Time to kill the bit rate. I mean, it's like every base beast master is like so cheap. 270 is so cheap. I just merged my horned owl onto his horned owl. <laughs> I mean, but if it, you gotta, you gotta plan it out though. You'd have to really make a chain of it. I mean, I guess that's what you would do. You have your water beast master, your Tyrannosaurus beast master, and then a whole chain of bird. You're just birding around, shooting the upgrades up all over the place. His range gets pretty good, huh? He could eat he could eat from there. I think I'm just gonna go until I lose with these guys. I mean, he's probably cheaper than... I mean, he's ex he's not cheap, but he's probably cheaper than the Boat Paragon. What would that be? Like, 150,000?
for the value and what that does to a bad. Because, like, you can reasonably... I mean, it would be hard. But you could get... Um, maybe on, like, Impoppable. Sell everything and then just make a max level... Megalodon and you would just eat the bad. You would definitely have 150,000 on the field. I think, well, can you not sell an Impoppable? I can't remember. You're at a carpet of spikes? You can sell? Let's see if they handle the, the camo, the DDTs. I mean, with a glue, they can do it. You really need a glue. I mean, th that's what they need. They need people to slow things down. And even then, it's not even for everything. It's just for, like, DDTs. What's the bird doing? Like, not even attacking the ZMG. <laughs> what is he doing? Uh, assuming you've got the money, there's no reason not to. Especially with the T-Rex with his bonus damage. Like, Bloon Impact would be amazing. Or Bloom Crush. But, I mean, that's that's more like round... I, I don't even know. I don't even know when you can afford Bloom Crush. Pump those ceramics like crazy. The, the the biggest issue with the Meg is if there's like like a bat or whatever on screen. You know, he's kind of stuck, stuck just like dragging one of those back as opposed to like doing like real good damage to everything. I mean, people, Comic the Hero, people were just saying like they already think it's better than the boat paragon because like it could one hit a bad i mean and it's i mean it's definitely really good there's no question about it i mean they know i mean it, it got past testing i mean they tested it they've been working on this guy for six months to a year you know is that you know you can only have one which means it can only drag one bat at a time. I, I mean, how often does it happen? I mean, it, again, it's it's going to make impoppable really easy. Because no matter what you did, assuming you sell everything on your screen, you could just buy a level 100, one, level 132 meg at the end, and it'll just one-shot the bat. Assuming there's water. They seem expensive. The orca is very expensive. The T-Rex, for how much damage he does, seems like really good. I'm not sold on the bird, but then again, the bird, I have not fully upgraded yet. We're about to lose. Not yet. Still need 30,000 more. I know, the, the issue with the bird is it doesn't do anything for DD, uh, camo leads. You would need men in black. Yeah, we just lost. All right. I was hoping we would lose. I got to go. What was that? A almost six hour stream? Jesus Christ. I got homework I got to do. <laughs> Everyone have a great night. Enjoy your balloons. It balloon responsibly. All right. I'm leaving. Goodbye.